Okay, so test, test. Test, test, test. Audio seems to be coming through nicely. That's good. Hello and welcome to part 12 of Valkyrie Chronicles 4. Where we last left off, we were up to this mission. So, let's get on to it. We're here to save the... Allow me to brief you on the upcoming operation. Um. Hmm. I forgot its name. Shit. I'm sure was. The Cavalier, there we go. Ah, oh, see. I knew I had something to do with C. Cavalier was surrounded by Imperials. Oh, no. <coughs> to break the encirclement, we'll take out the enemies in the wound and capture their camp. The wounds are divided into several stories, so we should aim to take the high ground. Scoring a vantage point, vantage point will make our offensive that much easier. I suspect that the Valkyrie Valkyria is nearby. The attacks are powerful, but they always travel in an arc. As long as you can find an overhang to take cover under, you should be alright. Wait, you know it's a ship, why don't you put it specifically in the ship area? Lock and load. <laughs> Bring uh Ready to play. Uh, leaders. I've got this. My turn. You're clear to deploy, Squaddy. Good luck. Gee, I'd hate to think if we won. Ah, oh, crap. Break through the enemy encirclement and rescue the cavalier. Squad E, move out. Hey. Oh, there we go. I had the bloody game volume set down. That would explain quite a lot. Captain Forsetti, how long are we to continue surrounding the enemy ship? Until I order you to move. But, sir, we've already eliminated the enemy's ground team. All that's left is to take control of the ship itself. Shouldn't we be preparing for... I said wait for orders. Don't move until my command. Sir. Mm. He hasn't come. But I was sure he would. What's Cremaria's condition? Just fine. Sitting there pretty as a princess. She's part of the plan this time, right? Seems like she's pretty happy about it. That's not important. I'm using a weapon to its full potential. Nothing more. There you go again. Talking like... Oh. Well, looky here. A guest of honor. Please don't tell me I have to deal with friggin the Vulcan and Clementia again. I knew they'd come. And then knew you would be. Sign of the Valkyria. The Martin Eater after all? No. They must have deployed her. It's definitely Forseti leading this attack. He's got to have something on his sleeve. Keep an eye out for changes in the environment. Moving to the Cavalier. Alright, so... We gotta capture those two. It... Does kind of look pretty simple. We have a couple units up there. Sightline. Engineer head there. 
sight line, and then open fire in the tank. Open fire in the camps. So for this side, grenadiers. This side, snipers. Straight up the middle will be shock trippers. Alright, first up, I don't really want to send Reed okay, out, out straight to die. I'm not that much of an asshole. I will see this through. And I will kill everyone. Enemy Hang on. Why does that look like a camp? Oh. That's yeah. stupid of ya. Trooper. Here I go. Gita. One bag. Gita. Hey, listen. Hey, listen. Me mind everyone on the most annoying character ever. Haha. <laughs> It's really not going to do much, but, uh... Next up... Hi, it's your turn. Now advancing. I do see the problem there. Oh, but I got a fire anyway. Try paying attention. Simply because. Yep. Really not gonna have much to do there. Okay, next up. Let's go. Glory. I've spotted the enemy. <coughs> Really? Another tank with your ass facing me. Like, bah, do you even? Okay, so we got... Really, the only big threat there is a freaking Lancer. And now they're gone. Let's go. Really, did I overplan this entire mission? I got the feeling I could just have a freaking unit charge straight in and capture. This is clearly an ambush. Stone cold silver. Like, if this isn't a clear ambush, I don't know what is. Witch, 
We're using yeah. lackluster tanks. And it's just like, seriously? The only problem is... Let's go. I actually gotta kinda... Move the glory back a bit. I do slow. Right, come in. Okay. Glory me in the bed. Uh... Follow my lead. Fall in. I got your back. Sure. Let's go. Yep. Let's go. <clears throat> Let's go to the um boat. Oh, I don't know. Pineapples and potatoes. Federation officer. I will not fall here. Ah, Scott, you. Eyes up. I don't like how you just stand there, boy. You gotta die. Okay, or conveniently not. I get the feeling that did significantly less than what I wanted. You're kidding. How could I have been shot? Like, I was expecting a tough fight. This... My turn. Okay, I could still not hit. So far, none. We strike as one. Yeah. Yeah. That was wonderful. Another job well done. That should do it. I don't like our entire strategy, you know, it's just freaking boil down to this. Sorry about that. Oh yeah, anti strategy. Uh, completely useless.
Get on my new to. Okay, I just need wires. Okay, survive somehow. But I will. Go on. Pat the cat. Pat the ow, ow. The enemy formation around the cavalier is crumbling. It's time. We shall advance and take back the Cavalier. Aye, sir. Engine room. Full speed. Boom. Bang. Bada. Destroyed. Uh, uh, Captain, are you all right? Just as you asked, with as little damage as possible. Good. Now eliminate the enemy troops we lure to the ship. Go now. Tear into them from behind. I don't need to hold back anymore. No. That's all I needed to hear. Come in, Bridge. What's the damage? Is everyone all right? The captain's not. We're all dead. So good. I can't get through. Corsetti was aiming for the Centurion all along. We can't count on support from the ship anymore. The soldiers in front of us and the Valkyria behind us are stuck in the pincer. No. What do we do, Claude? Claude! First, let's focus our attacks on one side. Attack the enemies in front of us with everything we have. <coughs> for a distance from the Valkyria. This is do or die. Forge ahead and break through the pincer. Let's go, everyone. Squad E, advance! The Vulcan's there. Are you kidding me? Mm. 
Yeah, I could have really handled this better. My pleasure. <sighs> the glory is completely destroyed. I can call it now. There you are. Bada. Beep. Bada. Oh, shit. Okay. So, gotta get the glory out of the way into the Vulcan. I can do this then. Yeah, you guys just kind of screw now. So I do this. You die. And then she gets sunk out. Oh, is that a picks up? Yeah, I just was didn't get the glory out. Show me a good time. Oh, I knew this was a bad idea. Burn it down. Impossible. Okay, somehow the glory managed to survive. I was chosen. And that I'm generally shocked by.
And she can move now. Okay, I hate her. No, I can't be. I really, really, really hate her. Oh, the kill sergeant. Holy shit, what the hell is your armor? What's point blank all shots hitting? Yeah, that's a stupid move. God damn it. I've got to stop unmuting myself when I do that. That mobility is incredible. Even if we could pin it down, our shots can't get through that armor. We need a plan, Claude! Between the witch and that tank, we're screwed! Damn it, what is that thing? Even I know the radiator's not supposed to be on top! Yeah, without a good vantage point, there's no way we can fight back. Wait, maybe we can use those ruins! Everyone, climb up to those ruins! Raz, secure the high ground! Cut into their formation! That's our way out of this, then leave it to me. Yeah, 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 medic. Can you rise, please? Don't let your equipment freeze up. Down them. Thanks. Reload. Don't let them get away. Okay, so that should be safe. I didn't know got not killing everyone. I right, hang on. Oh yeah, so it is a new set of enemies that come even if you don't do anything. So at least there's that. Now you're gonna die, trooper, whatever. Take what you can. Target eliminated. Keep up the good work. You two hide in here, hopefully old Kymentia.
I'll target that. Let's go. You're being targeted. The enemy has begun their counterattack. Say. Okay, or survive. Needs doing this time, and what needs doing is really, really what needs doing. I knew it was too freaking easy. Oh, I cut a pat. Sometimes you just you gotta pat a cat. But if she can't pat a cat, then I feel sorry for you. Really sorry. <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We've just read all these. It's been half an hour and I still haven't freaking done this. Okay, so. I'm gonna go with the original plan. But this time. We'll be using anti armor mortars. Alright, so we want the glory there. Onward to Vic. You better keep up. Lock and load. <laughs> I've got this. My turn. Hmm. I'll try my best. Lock and load. And let's see for that side. Oh, this is a thing that they fall on each side. No, oh, the same. Uh, Rita. I know, I know, I usually hate sending out all units, but essentially, the plan is, anti-tank mortars here, they'll fire, strand the Vulcan, this time I'll have both tanks down here, line up there, Bang, 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 bang. Just repeatedly pepper the Vulcan. Everyone, follow me. And we'll go from there. First, how much damage does this do? Four. Seriously? It does about 500 damage. I'll go with you. That is a really piss poor amount. Don't do anything rash. Enemies found them. Enemies.
But good to know I actually can hit the weak spots. Next, we want... Here comes the pain! Have units in position where they're going to capture the camps? Got enemies here! Unable to fire! I repeat, unable to fire! I don't see why we can't capture them now. Uh, for this side... Let's go! We'll have the glory... Since it'll of course be a lot easier to get back to where we need it. And the only major threat down here is these two tanks. That is actually quite a large range than I remember. Moving out. Not range, um AoE. She's not complaining about. The terrain's bound to give us the advantage. Do, 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 do. Wait, who's up there? Sniper, huh? Boom! Sorry, but I really don't want you dealing with my engineers. Engineers. Grenadiers. Why do I keep fucking that up? Come in, Centurion. Requesting fire support. Sending coordinates now. Get as much use out of it while well, I can. And fire! Bada boom! When I say. My hand. Okay, maybe it needs a day. A day, a ton. Uh, Tavancy push up in the middle. Mm -hmm. Claude, let's clear a path with the office. Oh, wait, hang on. Here I go. Is there like more areas that can be? Aha. Uh -huh. There's also like a stuck point up here. So I've actually got to get around for the. That is stupid. Oh, uh, we'll have... Right, right. I know it's not gonna do much since you know they're anti armor, but anti climactic, and then just like uh, let's see. Moving out. Kai, you can run down this way. Hey, buddy. Okay, that failed. 
And then on a single shot hit. I just... Uh, whoops. Falling back. I kind of goofed and went the wrong way there. Please respond. Please, you have to save them somehow. Now advancing. I have an ice hot cup of cocoa. Extracts cocoa. Get ice. Next, you. Let's go. Twenty billion more to go. Good, I'm not taking the risk. Our allies have been taken out. And you can't take the risk, you gotta blow him up. Blow him up by shooting men repeatedly in the head of a machine gun. You want to count a sniper battle me? Apparently you can Clever boy Look at me! Ma, I'm a genius! I damaged the tag! Woohoo! Woo, woo, woo! We can keep going. Yeah, I'd honestly say you can. I mean, the Harvins aren't gonna freaking blow off this from one shot to the front. Now, I don't really need to destroy every tank here. I am. Sorry for the little pause. I was just looking sunk up. Okay, moving out. Um, because I don't want them to start damaging me while waiting for the Vulcan. No! 
So two down there. You guys make me work for the Saintcha. Okay, moving out. Commencing counterattack. Follow my lead. Hmm. So I need to get my engineers up into that platform. Can I hit you first and then move on to the other one? Pinpoint accuracy, 100 percent. Advancing. Four tanks, one turn. Oh, tell me everything will be okay. Well, I wanna be the hunter, not the hunted. I wanna be the killer, not the prey. Yes, coming. My heart can't take much more. Constantly repeating every single beat I felt before. A single time I hit that wall somebody's hold me tight As I fall into the night I don't saw a chance to see the light Beating of the drum The drum and I heard so many times I've become known. I constantly tormented just for fun to never understand the starting gun. Hold your breath and punch too deep. My demons always have my soul to keep. I'm dying every time I fall asleep. You're gonna be reborn to being down. Got it. Your mind's up. Oh, you just believe it. If I can't. Live one more day. Never your turn. Can't take much more. Constantly repeating every single bean I felt before. Every single time I hit that wall. Storm bodies hold me tight. As I fall into the night, a chance to see the light. Give me a chance to see in the line. Alright, so what do we have guarding that camp? One scout, that's really not too bad. And is it a Falls to your neck to washes all the way. Captain Forsetti is a ruthless man. I've really got to get the freaking. Ah, oh, hang on. I. No, I can't. Damn it. I was just like, I can capture this area. I should have got a flagpole for a camp and then move them out. But. Uh, actually. You know, I kind of can.
Look, my arms, bitch. <laughs> I took it down by like, I think, 101 points. Much destruction. Truly, the chaos is unbridled. The fear, unparalleled. Really? On your own, but I so well. Someone cares. I can explain. Superhuman. The true fans. You got me hypnotized. I'm feeling so obsessed with you. You left me paralyzed. Now I'm stuck. You got me stuck. Oh. I never know. That's what I wanted. I don't know what's all the same. It's all safe picking up what I started The truth is, yeah, you got me hypnotized So obsessed with you You left me paralyzed, yeah and Now I'm stuck, you got me stuck Oh, me hip, no ties. Feeling so obsessed with you. Left me paralyzed. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm stuck. Got me stuck. Going fucking crazy. Great dodge, dude. Like, actually, no, he didn't even dodge, that was just a mess. Let's go. One more. Yeah, I was hoping for a bit more damage, to be honest. I'm generally actually surprised that that managed to hit. <laughs> now, bring out the two tanks. Damn it. They got our I should find a section and all this on switch. So, tank one will be here. Just so it's start. Recovering health. I honestly don't really like its name. Not saying there's much wrong with it, just yeah, glowy for tank. Okay, so can I get you up so I don't want to have to deal with reinforcements to the enemy's side? Just tell me if the cold's got you feeling tough. God, I didn't want you, you bastard. I wanted a freaking 
I wanted the camp, not you. Absolute fattest story. <sighs> All right. Uh, really got no one over this side, so to worry about them. I got this. Got enemies here. I know, I know. What am I doing? I had to rise up there for a reason, but hear me out. You got a bomb, mate. You're in violation of the not burning treaty. That means if you're not burning, you have to burn. Um, uh, no. So it's very kind of up in the air what a burning treaty means. Uh, could mean any number of things. It could even mean that you could not be burning. But regardless, we must preach the word of Burnham, Bernstein, Burn it, Burn Burn it, Burn it, Not ending it yet. Uh, wait one more turn. And that's I get the feeling I am not going to get an A rank. Okay, so they do spawn. Wait, what? I had them set up perfectly at the thing. Now I gotta move them. The enemy has begun their counter attack. Um, what? Is this thing on fucking crack or something? Dear fucking god! What the fuck? Seriously? That's just the fucking gun! This is the fucking machine gun and is doing that. Are you fucking kidding me? The machine gun just melted the glory's armor like it was 
freaking butter. What the hell? Advancing. Alright, so I've got to send my units up there. So now, though, can I freaking stack waz, please? Fucking man. hell! Oh, she knows. Have you heard of a Lord and Savior burn up like burn up? Beat bo bonus time. You haven't? That is a year, right? Shame. Bonum, 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 we out of every troopers that survive recommend him. I'm just kidding, no one freaking survives. <laughs> uh, Alright, so. Yeah, that is actually quite a lot of units still over there. Holy shit, yep. Wow. And I'm definitely not getting a freaking B rank. Minerva, it's your turn. Follow my lead. Federation officer. I will not fall here. Yes, coming. Fall in. Sure. Let's go. I swear though the Vulcan went from being a souped up freaking badass tank to pure hack. Time's up, kids. Okay, that did last time as well as hoping. For the glory of Squad F. Ah, my scope's fucked. Oh shit! End, end, end. This <laughs> is like charge the crap, crap, crap. Shit, shit, swag, swag, swag. No oh, dodge, dodge, duck, dive, dip, dodge, and avoid. Hey there, kid. Come on. Your own damn fault. No, I'm not a freaking idiot. Let's kick up some orders. Uh, first aid. This is an order. Do, 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 do. This is an order. Defensive formation. Brace for enemy attack. 
I know, it's not bracing for an enemy attack, it's running straight into the enemy. That's the problem! <laughs> it's bracing for enemy attack, soldiers. Yeah. Shoot straight into the enemy. Okay, so... Can I hit... I don't think I can. Uh, chipper, chipper. You seem like... It'd be the most annoying out of the lot. I see. Haha, little did you know. Dead. The enemy has begun their counterattack. Who's gonna die first? Damn it, see, I was hoping that you'd fire on your own soldiers again. The enemy has begun their counterattack. But I guess. Ah, okay, that I was expecting a bit more. Hey, guess what, buddy? <laughs> um, fight. You've won the Bernie McBurney, Bernie McBurney, Bernie Stein, Bernie, 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 Participation award no. for burning. I know it's a shocker to think, but you did win. Okay. Uh... Right, right. Get these two into position, and I'm really, really hoping. But they don't pull a hey, we're now going to switch the location of these two. <sighs> Alright, so. Roger. Cause the boss is on the line the contract that we sign Cause we all the down, all the down Gamble with our time Make us chances on the sign The stack on high Cause we all the die, all the die, all the All the die, 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 Should be okay. Was apparently still be down the bottom. Had I known that, I wouldn't have ended the fucking turn there. Uh, you know what? I actually have you up here. So I'm really hoping that it doesn't pull like a BS thing and alter the positions again. I've got everyone in the position where I want them to be. It's been over an hour and on this one mission. <sighs> uh, 
let's do this, lads and ladettes. Please don't screw up my positions, please don't screw up my positions. Okay, you didn't buy these two are oh, in a really bad spot. It's a Vulcan or it's a gun. Leave it to me. Come on. I'm hitting its core directly. What the hell? Yeah, see, I knew it. Up there does there get go. turned into a camp. You sneaky little bastards. Bank and I won't notice. Well, guess what? Apparently, you're a bit strong. How does that take 87 shots? I swear I thought that was a helmet then. Seriously, are these guys just that much more powerful? Oh, I, uh, I ain't liking this. Fancy, I'm gonna need you to keep an eye on those two. If time allows, I'll be able to kill them. Minerva, you're getting the fuck out of there. Okay, moving out. Kill Sergeant. Fire. More hacks, I see. How lovely. Okay. I out. too like when enemies use hacks. Okay, so apparently, take out Gatlin Tower. Apparently, Gatlin Tower OP, please not. God damn it, I've got a freaking <sighs> Really instantly regretting that I didn't leave Rise up there or anyone to deal with that. Come on. How is that thing still alive? What the hell? I think right, you'll turn a school off. Right, right. Connor, not McGregorinston. You'll have to go. Oh, this got nasty. Tow it down. Let's go. Which hopefully should mean the glow is not going to get. Yep. Alright, guess what? You're dealing with two tanks now, son. Never mind. 
turns out even with two tanks firing. That, what the hell? It was never this tough before. Like, they literally just crank this thing up to a hundred with its friggin' resistance. Kill Sergeant is down. Finally. Right, right. You've still got two shots, and then I'm gonna have to. Force you to retreat straight after this, because I need to get the glory out of there. Like, with how low his health is. No! I didn't... Oh, okay, thank fuck. I thought that accidentally picked him. I was like, I didn't want to do that. That's going to fuck up the entire plan. I got a lot of freaking CP back. Well, well. We can keep going. I was chosen. You're trying to kill us. Most people take that personal. Well, personally. I mean, I don't know. Well, sometimes it's like, it's not personal. But, I mean, you're still trying to kill them, dude. I'll make you suffer. God, I was seriously hoping that freaking anti-armor bloody mortars would do the job. Oh, come on. They're not even they're using really weak grenades. I really feel bad for them. That mobility is incredible. Like, see, just freaking imagine if you could have that at the end. Like, Imagine just how awesome that would be. Keep calm, maintain formation, and circle around. See, I don't really get the whole. Oh yeah, freaking get the high ground, but. Well done. 
Wait. High ground of what? You need explosives to deal with that. Like, it's not really something you can just go, oh yeah, this is going to be easy to deal with. There. Shit, why did I do that? Now we're going to waste another turn. Okay, so, Iofi. My heart is pounding. Leave it to me. Move! We've got winter on our side. Whoa there. Also, apparently, got the most OP tank in history. the Hoffman can survive one extra shot. She, she's only got one shot. Yeah, okay, so I can use her, then the Hoffman, and then repair. Because this is seeming less impossible since I took out that Gatlin tart. Like, kinda not as nigh impossible as I thought. Thank you. Considering the fact that that freaking Gatlin tart pretty much decimated the bloody. Glory, like somehow that thing was firing anti armor, just magic hack shells. Unless I swarm the main base camp, I'm not too fast. Yeah, it's having a real hard time trying to path around the happen. Yeah, it's it's one of those days. Let's see. That does 900 damage. Yeah, this movie is a lot friggin' less impossible once you know what you're doing. Bastard. Advancing. All right, so. Got this. Oh. 
Find somewhere you can climb up. You guys up there, Minerva, you're going to be the one to deal with Scan Shock Trooper that appear up there. All this equipment is weighing us down. So that's fine enough. I don't want any problems up here. Damn it, I'm pinned down. Uh, I guess I should bring Y in there so no one captures it. Good job. I'm a one -man army. I should have saved for this, yeah. Falling back. Alright. Take two. Whenever. Moving out. You gotta be up first. No, that's coming. Federation I guess officer. since you can't I will not see me. I gotta keep these two up here without too much. No, oh, can I fucking just end these? Worry that they're going to get mowed down. Okay, moving out. Us. Lock you. Sergeant Hacks again, okay. Advancing. I will see this through. Fugler. Right there. Okay, I'll keep freaking hacksing. Victorious. Tank. Not sure if you know what that means, but yeah, but that means. Dodging doesn't fucking help. We can get a shot on you to make you turn around. How is that not even a surprise attack? The worst part is, I can't even. Advancing. Keep firing. Right there. The enemy has begun their counterattack. 
And now we gotta bloody actually start focusing on taking down the cannon. So you retreat. Your turn. <sighs> and can I get a casualty report? Well, I don't. Can I get a casualty report? Shouldn't you be worrying about your own casualty reports on this ship? This should do it. Muscles Karen. I don't know. I don't do voices so well. Everyone. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, that stuff, they're not Karen. Well, it's just secretly really into capturing bases. Like, oh, you yeah, captured that base so hard. Hey, da, buddy. You gotta die for me. Yeah, yeah, I did. Nah, I'm doing a shock about that. Always not fucking not. That was a wee white tone of event. It really mildly does not is the thing. Here I go. I don't know why I picked Rita. Watch out. We're watching you. It's like ah I'm actually causing you damage, let me patch you up. How many sets? Three, six, eight shots. So we got eight shots. Fuck it, you need to die first. Great job. And then it's one shot. I guess about three, six every turn. Okay, Vulcan. Me bombs. El bombos metal volcano. Someone, someone find that way, so I'm probably sure. Now, but it's not. Uh, could the genre be El Explosive Roro? We're fine. Minimal damage. Hmm. I think that does a bit more damage to the, the Gatlin turret, but it also damages the bloody Hoffin. We can keep going. But that's a risk I'm willing to take. I would actually have won last time, okay. <laughs> except obviously, You're being targeted. you know, wait, hang on. Oh, okay, it's just one of those stupid little inventory. You be careful. You're on the ship that was just attacked. <laughs> Maybe I should move it a bit to there. You're essentially tasked with blowing up a tank. I wouldn't exactly call that stress-free vacationing. 
Holy shit. It's been an hour and a half. I'm taking down this mission. Show me a good time. No big deal. I was chosen. Actually, I'm kind of wondering if Crimentia captured the base, in which case I'll be more embarrassing. I'll make you suffer. You already do every time you, um, do the cattail. I now have a cattail, and I'll also be right back. Alright, we are back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Leave it to me. Gonna do what a fire. Wait, did I bring out two shock troopers there? I did. Crap. My heart is pounding. And it is. 
take aim. Fire! Going okay. to lose. Leave it to me. Oh yeah, shit! I could actually just use that order. We're fine. Minimal damage. Hmm. You only got one shot, and I want to make sure. Uh, okay, is that anti-tank power? I want to make sure it goes kaboom. This is an order. Find your weak link and break through it. Let's really end it with a kabang. I'm gonna use this and it's just going to friggin' screw up. This is an order. Blast those tanks with everything you've got. Like, it's just, okay. I'm gonna forget that. Oh, yeah, crap, she's out of ammo. Last count. Last round. Boom. Vada, a bip, boom. We're being pushed back, vaults. Withdraw and regroup for now. So, Claude, you broke through it after all. That's right, son. That's how you do it. Retreating. Are they trying to regroup? This is the Cavalier. Calling the Centurion and all deployed units. I repeat, this is the Cavalier. Calling the Centurion and all deployed units. Say some of the guns are back online and they're going to open fire on our these cunt. Is immobile. We cannot continue our mission. Shit. Therefore, it has been set to detonate. God damn it. What? What are they blowing up? Leave the blast radius immediately. Get as far away from this ship as you can. It's this. this Lord, we need to get out of here. I've got a really bad feeling about this. <sighs> We're still out of contact with the Centurion. They might not have even heard that. We have to go back and tell them the Cavalier is exploding. Fair point. I was expecting something really bad. Like, I was not expecting a good rank for that. Kitty. Uh, okay. Take care of him first. It's almost torn off. <laughs> we can't reattach that. Karen, I'll need you to amputate and sew it up. Understood? Yes, Doctor. Damage confirmed on the starboard side. There's a fire. Hurry up and put it out. Anyone with yeah, blood wounds, return to your post as soon as you're treated. We've got enemy reinforcements coming. Damn it. We're so close to the capital. Doctor, I've got someone wounded. They need attention now. Idiot. Patient priority is the doctor's call, not... It's the captain.
We've got heavy blood loss from the femoral artery and severe burns on his right upper arm. I understand. I'll do what I can. Oh, hang in there, Captain. Captain? Everyone is... Valkyrie power is activated. Valkyrie power is activated. Different destruction! Cat. <laughs> We're still not getting any more speed out of the engine! Damn it! We're not gonna make it! Brian! Claude, I'm busy. Wait in the hangar until further orders. Don't give me that. Talk to me. I know the Cavalier said something about a detonation. You want us on the ship and out of the blast zone. What the hell's going to explode? Why is it so urgent? What are we running from? I can't tell you. This is bigger than the military. We're talking about state secrets. Either way, this isn't fast enough. We won't make it in time. What do you mean we won't make it? Oh shit, god damn it, my bumper dropped again. What's about to happen? Fuck you, bomb. And they're gonna be pissed that they're blowing up another Valkyria. There she goes again. Giving me the cold shoulder already? This was supposed to be our big reunion. Not gonna go after her, huh? I guess a handsome devil like you never has to chase the ladies. We damaged the Centurion significantly. They won't get far, and we can track them if need be. Our priority right now is securing the Cavalier. That thing's pretty beaten up by now. Still, I guess the Federation tag is a fine enough prize. Well, if that's the plan, let's get all up in there. It's been a while since I gotta break out the CQC. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> what? You gonna be lonely without me? No. Hmm? What's wrong? We shouldn't be here. Run. Dear God. No! Yep, Valkyria bomb. The pot thickens like pudding. Which now I really want some pudding. Not gonna lie, some pudding would be great. It's chaos everywhere. We have to get this situation under control. Captain hasn't come back. He told me to turn to you for a decision in an emergency like this. What are your orders? How can I give orders if I don't even know what's going on? I can't give you details. I don't have clearance for that. All I can say is when it's over, there will be nothing left. That's the only thing I can tell you. Claude, we need our final orders. The ship is still moving. Don't talk like this is the end. I'm not giving any orders for a lost cause. 
As long as I'm alive, I'll keep fighting. I don't care what happens. Full speed ahead! Riley, come in! Pod, what's happening? We need this ship to go fast, even if it's just one more knot. Got it. If it won't listen to me, I'll just give it some more tough love. Break it if you have to. Just get us moving faster. Will do. <laughs> Please. Wherever you are, you have to go back. It's the only way. her limits a long time ago you really pushed it to the edge but we can do better hey you can't just it's fine Claude's taking responsibility I just have to do the best I can the compression valve should be designed to handle more I'm opening it all the way the fluxometer too I think we can take two full revolutions of the needle damn near incredible wish the kid could have seen it oh Oh, you don't mean Angie, do you? Yeah, she just wandered through here not that long ago. Why would she come to the engine room? And where did she go? Ah, who knows? I saw her snooping around the restricted area, so I shooed her away, but... Uh... The Forbidden Sector is where we first found her. <gasps> huh? What about your tuna? Just keep making the adjustments. I gotta go check something out. Hey, where you going? for the coat. It was really warm. Angie! I remembered who I am. Well, I sort of remembered a while ago. There's something I have to do. It's the only way I can help everyone. I knew that, but I couldn't do it. I was having too much fun with all of you. I never felt so warm before. Nobody's ever been as kind to me as all of you were. I... I just wanted to stay with you forever. Angie? I'm scared, Riley. But... but I have to be... who I truly am.
I mean, she'd been paddling the ship the entire time. I'm not sure it's a death sentence, really. It's... It's over. Did you hear that? That means... This is the engine room. The main reactor's got power again. It just came back on, damn it. She came back. Brian! Right. Give us everything you've got. Full speed ahead. Hold on tight. We're kicking this baby into overdrive. That is a huge blast. Well, in the ship, how the hell did the other guys make it out? Dear God. Looks like we managed to make it into the safe zone. Don't look away, Captain. That light is our last hope. Our last. Hope? Okay, how do these guys get away so quickly? Like, where on a ship? How the hell what did these guys... Is that? Another one? Another one I couldn't say! God damn it! <laughs> Jeez, I wonder fucking why. Like, you can't sit there playing the high fucking horse like, I'm attacking these ships to save them. Who did you get to damage them, you bastard? Clementia. Attacked the comet. It sunk because of Nicola and Chiara. Now, what would happen if you, know, you didn't choose to attack them? That's still be safe. You nearly destroyed the Centurion. By dropping bombs onto it. And who did you get to disable that ship? The last one. The last one, at least. I have to save her. Again, you killed them. Not by your actions, but by your orders. The Cavalier blew itself up 
to avoid being captured because you disabled it, preventing it from leaving. You fucking what the idiot. Going on here? Hey, about before. <laughs> oh, are you crying? She was so sad. I could hear her. I'm suffering. It hurts. I want to live. Ah! Boo fucking who, you goddamn fucking bitch. Who fucking attacked her? What, could you hear the other one too? It's dark. I'm drowning. I can't breathe, you fucking bitch. And even through all the pain, she wanted me to escape. The bolts. I, I hate them. I'll never forgive what they have done. Cremaria. What they've done? I think all this is over my head. The f okay, so just going off what I know, the Imperials were the ones that pretty much butchered you, tortured you, and completely broke you. Okay, they did all that. The Federation. Let's. Plug them up to a ship. But... Yeah, I can see they're really in the fucking wrong here. I see a lady crying. <sighs> like, I'm fucking sorry. You cannot sit and play the goddamn victim after you attack the ships. Like, just, you, you cannot fucking sit there and tell me that. Oh, yes. Oh, this yes. fucking cunt again. How could anything be so perfectly, achingly beautiful? It's heaven's light. The light of creation. And oh my god, just oh, die. Son, crafted by human hands. A beacon of hope. To light the path of mankind. You've done it, Al. Albert Miller, my dearest friend. Your final gift. This great Prometheus. The no. no, 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 no. I am the one who will change this world as Al's friend. It is my privilege, my right. <laughs> yes, I will be the one to finally grant your wish. Only I ever truly understood you, Al. I was your friend. And so, I work in your stead. I will see it done. <laughs> Angie, why? 
Looks like a gun. Real indication that she's dead. This handwriting. Like, you could literally just go. Oh yeah, shit. Um, let's end this war so we can unplug Angie. What did you say this ship's running on? It's running on her. What? What the hell's that supposed to mean? Angie's just a little girl. What do you mean she's powering the ship? It's not just the Centurion. The Cavalier. The Comet. All the ships were the same. <laughs> Our ship runs on Angie's power. The power of the Valkyria. Like again. Compare that to what the Imperials are doing. As far as you guys know, the only crime that they've really done Valkyria is yes, the main reactor is fueled by a Valkyria. Each ship was assigned one. On paper, they're civilian contractors. And the one assigned to the Centurion is named Angie. Angelica Farnaby. Wait, uh, hold on. Just what is a Valkyria? Like, uh, plug them into a power cord? Or use them as a freaking power source? Or use them as a weapon? One's allowed freedom to destroy so much stuff. One did just kill two Valkyries, the Comet and the Cavalier, so... <gasps> oh my god, the other just can apparently be unplugged. At least I'm... I heard they're descendants of the ancient Valkyrie. Who protected this land a long time ago? Maybe a bit more. Yeah. I've already been told that the Empire is weaponizing them, and that the Winter Witch is one specialized for combat. But you're saying the Federation has their own Valkyria, not even as weapons, but as living batteries? Again, That's just saying correct. that Angelica has been modified to act as a power source. Like By it's worse. She can generate energy far beyond conventional compression. She alone can produce enough energy to power this entire cruiser. That's why the restricted area was so heavily guarded. You're using a human being. You locked a little girl in the reactor of a military ship. Would you rather they use her to fucking win this war? Claude, she volunteered for this. She signed a waiver agreeing that she and her life belonged to the military. There's no way that could be legitimate. On the contrary, it's a legally binding contract. Just like the one you signed when you were living. <laughs> now see, again, you're trying to play the fucking mole high horse here like, oh, it's so fucking bad. Ask any soldier fighting in a war you yourself are prepared as a soldier you should be prepared to die trying to win this fucking war so as in that's it no more life for you you lose the life fucking lottery you're dead Ask any soldier you're fighting along. If you could give your life to help win this war, would you? N at least 90% would say, yes. I want this war over. The Empire is doing terrible fucking things. Go up. Ask a Valkyria. Would you be willing to use your powers 
to help win this war. It was an accident that she left the main reactor and met you all, and suffered amnesia at that. But once she remembered her duty, she returned to the main reactor of her own volition. How is this even possible? She and all the others volunteered for this initiative. They're doing whatever they can for their homeland. See? Like, again, I'm sorry to keep bringing up this fucking point, but they're just being used as a power source. They could be doing a lot worse. Like, they could be turned into living war. Both the Cavalier and the Comet are gone. Living weapons. Indeed. Valkyria's fates are tied to their ships. They knew the risks. Yeah, the and who power of the sunk them? Would be unattainable without Valkyrian support. And Operation Cygnus is impossible without these ships. This plan has been in the works for a long time. I knew it. This was already being prepared even before Operation Northern Cross. Correct. The United States of Vinland developed these ships and their tech. They are the hidden orchestrators of Cygnus. Like you're saying. How deep does this rabbit hole go? You're saying it's bad that they had a backup Are plan. You to abandon the mission, then? Would you betray your allies just to take the moral high ground? Betray my allies? For every day we move forward on the Crystal Sea, our allies on land are retreating from the Empire. As we speak, the Federation's death toll keeps on growing. Operation Northern Cross is a lost cause. The Cygnus fleet is the only hope we have of ending this war. <laughs> and here we are, two days from the Imperial capital. Three at most, even with combat. Then, you plan on storming the enemy's capital with Angie still hooked up to the main reactor? That's correct. Claude. Do you believe the captain will wake up from this? I don't know. I can only hope so. We'll need a decision. Soon. Who else could make that call without being swayed by emotion? <sighs> Please, Captain. We need you to wake up. Look out. He brought it up himself. Like, if you were given the option, would you use a little girl as a power source to get to the capital quicker to end this war, or would you say, no, let's turn those three days into a week. That's four extra days. In fact, it would probably be longer than a week. But that's extra days where your allies are actively fighting on the retreat. That's meaning the Empire is pushing closer and closer and closer to your homeland. Yeah, leave because you want to be friggin' just, oh, I'm so moral. Yeah, yeah, I get fucked. And again, Chimera. That oh, I hate that. The ship? All this I hate them work? using Valkyria as reactors. Gee, it's so much worse when you use them as weapons. It's so much worse when you fucking disable the ship, causing it to blow up, you stupid fucking idiotic bitch. I'm sorry I keep calling her a bitch, but she, she was the fucking cause for Seti was the fucking cause. They are to blame. They cannot claim I'm doing this to save those little girls when you blow two up. In fact, it's worse. You sunk one. Like, I would fucking take an explosion that kills you outright over drowning in the reactor of a ship. Like, the crushing depth, the darkness, 
the unable to get out would be far, far worse. Huh. What is this shit? Is, is this supposed to be a joke? Actually, worse if that is airtight. Because you'd be sinking in, slowly running out of air, then the glass would crack. Slowly at first, but then smash. Guess what? Now that water huh? is drowning the poor to go. She was smiling. She said she had to go back to where she belonged. Then the door closed, and she was locked inside. She was looking at me until the main reactor came on. She was smiling the whole time. You think she wanted this? I think she wanted to save us. And that was the only way. But she's just a goddamn kid. We're using this child as a tool of war? Read this. To my favorite big sis, Riley. First, I want to say I'm sorry. I wanted to tell you what I really am, but I just couldn't. When I got on this ship, I signed a piece of paper. It had a lot of big words, but it said the military would take care of my family after I'm gone. After that, I drank some medicine, and it tasted really bad, and I got really sleepy. And then I was in the Forbidden Sector, and the whole time I was in there, I was dreaming. It was a really scary dream. Lots of people were fighting. They got hurt and died. So when I woke up, and I met all of you, and everyone was so kind to me, I've never felt happier in my life. Even though there's a war going on outside, the ship is like a really big house with a really big family. But I have a family back home, too. There's my papa, and one little sister, and two little brothers. Papa just drinks all day and doesn't go to work. That's why we didn't have any money. But then, men in uniforms came to my village. They told us to take an aptitude test. And that's how I learned I could be a Valkyria. I could be useful. So I made a promise with the soldiers. They'd give Papa money and help my sister and brothers go to school. And in return, I'd go away on this ship. What? To tell you the truth, I really didn't want to do it. I wanted to stay home with my family. But if I didn't help, they told me a lot of happy families would be sad, and lots of people might get hurt. They said it was my duty to help, so I decided it was the right thing to do. Duty. But you know what? I actually kind of liked being here. I think I learned something from everybody on the ship. Okay, they did kinda strong arm her into it, but, I mean, really, like, it's better than soldiers coming in and be like, yeah, guess what, you're all under imperial control now, haha, <laughs> you're dead. what it means to protect someone you love, and I- So I'm going back, to the place where I belong. I'm really proud that I could help protect everyone. Thank you, Riley. And tell everyone else things, too. Goodbye. Holy shit! What the hell is this? Claude, this operation's over. We're taking Angie, and we're getting the hell out of here! You... Fucking... God... 
damn idiot. Like, for fuck's sake, I can't stand people like this. What's this? We have to take the moral high ground. They're using a kid. It's so mean. If we do that, this ship will stop dead in its tracks. They'd never make it to the Imperial capital. You think I give a shit? What the hell kind of victory is worth killing an innocent girl? Oh yeah, cause when the fucking Empire killed Wily's parents, killed everyone of Squad F. Yeah, fucking shut the fuck up. Wiley, you feel the same way, right? Like just fucking how? Oh come on, Kai, say something. I think I finally see why my brother left the Federation. Cause a place where they're torturing Valkyria I mean, Valkyria so is so much fucking better. This? He always avoided saying anything outright. All he'd tell me is that the Federation had been twisted. Like if this goes deeper. After seeing this shit, I'd say the same thing. I can't take this. You see what they've done to her? <sighs> if what Clementia said about how they, the experiments they don't hurt, yeah, this is so much worse. It's unforgivable, but... Kai? But in this moment, all I know for sure is that Angie is fighting harder than any of us. <laughs> Angie wants peace. She chose this path herself. She's fighting her own battle, her own war, in the blue fires of that reactor. All we can do for her now is fight at her side. <sighs> An attack! <laughs> Couldn't even give us time to think, huh? Ragnite better than anyone, so I need to ask you something. That explosion that came from the Cavalier, was it? Did that explosion come from the main reactor? <laughs> the reactor's energy output is hundreds of times beyond whatever we could achieve through standard compression. But even with that kind of power, I don't know if it would trigger a chain reaction as massive as the one we saw. <clears throat> Look. I'm sure I could give you an answer if I had time to analyze the data, but I'm sorry. I just... I'd really rather not think about all that right now. No, I'm sorry. I was being insensitive. The squad we're up against is probably the one we fought before, led by the black-plated tank. I know you've got a lot on your mind, so for now, let's just focus on winning this battle. Got it. We're moving full pelt in a freaking ship. Like, unless they've got Quimentia actively shooting at us. But spoiler, you dumb bitch is just gonna freaking make this ship enough of all. HQ would personally request the Ausbrook for this assignment. That massive explosion probably got the top brass panicking. <laughs> Can't blame him. One of those things went off inside the capital. If it's gotta explode, make it happen on the Crystal Sea, far away from the capital. HQ's orders. So we're the expendable pawns again, huh? Not if I have anything to say about it. Cromeria's heading for the enemy ship from the other side. We'll distract it from the front, and she'll destroy it. Destroy? If I recall, Belgar and Agent Forsetti seem pretty intent on capturing that ship in one piece. Not happening. We are sinking that thing. Orders be damned. Some things just can't be allowed to exist. Huh? Well, 
Destruction's fine by me. I'm just hoping one of our shots doesn't set the damn thing off, sir. <laughs> no worries. Cremaria's gotten better with her power. She's more stable now. She won't lose control. I'll look after her. Yeah, whatever you say, lover boy. <laughs> anyway, thanks to HQ's meddling, we're finally out of Doc Belgar's jurisdiction. Once we're done here, I think it's time for us to take a nice long vacation. To be honest, I was terrified of that Winter Witch when I first saw her. Maybe it's just me, but ever since she met you, she's gotten more approachable, more human. She's been acting, dare I say, cuter. I understand why you'd want to protect her, sir. You might find she's a little too hot for you to handle. <laughs> Don't worry, sir. I'm not making a move on her. You've got enough enemies without you trying to kill me, too. Hmm? That silhouette. Lieutenant Colonel Volts, the enemy ship's been sighted. We're moving at full speed to engage. This is it. My soulmate and I get to have one last dance. I will protect the capital. My men, my motherland, and the woman I love. I'll protect them all. I've been a lot more ran in this one, but again, they can't like uh, just is really ticking me off. It's like, oh, let's play the more freaking high ground of this bullshit. None of them are really worth getting right now. Wow, a masterpiece! And let's see if the cactus is anything. So really, not much worth getting. I'm gonna call it here. I know it's been a really shorter one, but just uh, chapters, honestly. It took me off too much. Apologize for the ranting? But I will catch you all later, and as always, have a good day. If you liked it, that's awesome. If you didn't, I honestly cannot blame you. Anyway, as I said, have a good day, and I'll catch you all later.